Hi there, and welcome to another video with me, Mike, aka Damn Profit. Now, I am going to take you to this destination, which looks completely blank and boring and uninteresting. But we will learn, as per you saw in the video, we are going to go hunting for the Leviathan. The very location where the next raid will be announced in T-12 hours GMT time. So, no further ado. What you need to do is ignore the, pu the uh, public event. Incoming cabal is load up your map wherever you are in the, uh, in the Destiny universe. Go to Nessus and go to the system. Fast travel to there and you will load in. Like so. He says. You load in and like this. And as you can see, I've got my HUD disabled so I don't get distracted by what's going on. And we are essentially heading for this building here. And we are just gonna go to just below the main door there. So when you load in, get your bike out, hit the button, and off we go. Blast across the map in your sparrow. And this is dead simple. This really is a very, very simple out of map glitch that shows us quite a lot. So, fly across, fly across here, Ignore all the enemies, they don't care. Hit the water, just don't stop. If you stop, you'll start getting electrocuted. Keep going, keep going, hit this little bump here. Just so you're going in the right direction. And we're aiming for this piece of time map here. So, boost up this wall. Boost up this wall. Go to this ledge here, we're aiming to go for this bit here. So stand directly in front of the wall, straight as you can, just double jump and you should be straight in. And then we're trying to go for this hole here. This is just a wall, it's a piece of graphics. So you just come tight, jump up, and just hold left and you'll go straight over the wall. We are now out of the game map. We are into a totally different area. So what we need to do now is go down this little hole, jump off the edge, because there's some electric water below us and we are going to be jumping for this bit of beam here so you'll see one two three the fourth step in it'll be the one that dips and as you'll see there is some bits of scenery here these you can physically stand on but you can't see them from the other side so simply just jump up you'll land jump up again and then just jump onto this block here. Turn around 180 degrees and we're aiming for this block now. So just run, jump up here and then turn around and what we're aiming for is this area here. As you can see we've got the two suns. So jump up Make sure that you're in the gap. Right. And you've got the sun. And Mercury. And the moon and the sun. So, you want to just kind of mooch around now. Now this is the difficult bit because sometimes it works and sometimes it doesn't. So I spend roughly around an hour to an hour and a half trying to get this to work. So what I did was I couldn't quite get it working and I think it's down to server that you log into and what I mean by that is that when I logged in this boulder wasn't here uh, those, the suns definitely weren't there either and also as well that a lot of this glitchiness wasn't here. So I had a really good, clean image, what I had early. So this is more, I think, trial and error at different times of day, afternoon, night, and maybe after tomorrow you can't even see. Now you can see some features, 
there are buildings over here with items being sucked off into the nether earth you'll see down here it looks like total destruction and there's some more which are just there and what it usually leads to we just spend a small amount of time just looking around here is something usually comes out now I'm not going to bore you with that because it does take quite a while but what I'm going to do is I'm going to say set the scene up so I had this little box here was just about there I had a bit of the flooring in and pretty much this was what I was looking at now just to demonstrate there's my Mida multi tool and here is me switching my weapons so what happened was I was doing exactly the same thing because I'd read about this glitch on reddit I'd read about lots of video on YouTube with someone going to it and having these same problems but luckily I'd gone much earlier on around 1 o'clock in the morning GMT time and what I got was this so as you can hear in the background that is a cabal but nothing is moving on screen this is a photograph a screenshot that I took of my PS4 when I was doing this so what actually happened was I started to move my controller a bit and the reason that there's no gun on the screen was I was just I was literally doing I was literally doing this and just flicking my guns in and out and taking pictures till I got one without a gun in. So I'm at this more point, I'm moving my cursor around and then what came out was this. And I was like, holy shit. On one of the videos I've watched, there was something like this in the video, but it was a bit foggy and there was loads of fog here and this couldn't be part so this couldn't be seen you could see the outline and this little bit on top but it was really foggy and this came through and it was literally crystal clear so i was like whoa this is the leviathan and just to just to prove to you that's monitor that's game that's monitor that's game it's exactly the same location give or take a few frames so um, I ended up here and what I found out was by waiting in this position once you can get the Leviathan on the screen and I think it purely is around the server that you log into and there's no rhyme or reason you just have to try and keep trying it until one appears when this appeared on my screen uh, this was one that was about five to ten minutes afterwards when I first got there and the fog cleared up and it presented this really clear image of the Leviathan and I was like, whoa, that, that suits. If you look here, you've got all the little villages in the mouth. You've got stuff flying in, which ties in with these buildings here, creeping away. You've got bits on the side in the command module at the top. It all fitted the concept art of the Leviathan. This is our next raid location. There is no doubt about it. This is our next raid location. So, I carried on waiting and it got a bit more misty as you can see here are the buildings we were just looking at on the ps4 shots and it got a bit more misty and it was a bit bad and then the sh the money shot came in this was an an image where the fog cleared the image went crystal clear there was no it just it went beautifully clear and you can completely see the leviathan for everything that it is so we have got the command bridge module we have got some little node which probably might be a sensor bar you've got all these nuts and bolts or lasers or whatever they are to chew up planets that come through you've got debris flying into its mouth from this here you've got all the little constructs or houses along with these here this thing is huge so it's it's everything that we wanted the leviathan to be and i wanted to share that with you that if you just follow that simple video that, that simple entrance to get to this glitch area and you spend a little bit of time 
just playing around at just the right point, you will see the Leviathan appear. And it sounds really stupid, but it was worth it because you don't kind of get the scale that this thing is. It is huge and it just dominates the map and as you can see just trying to get it back into view in the live screen so that you can see it from a perspective come on stupid thing you're supposed to be able to see it better at night that's the other thing you're supposed to be able to see it better at night at that location you it, it, this was the picture. This was the best picture I've seen. All the other pictures were a bit blurry. You couldn't see a lot. There was fog. This was the most clearest. And this categorically identifies that this is the Leviathan. Where Imperia Cassus, Emperor Cassus, that was cast out by Gaul, took this ship to live in exile, and has somehow ended up back here for some reason. I'm, I'm sure we're going to find out why. So... Uh, this picture is available on my website, danprofit.com. It's all I've, I've posted it on social media, Twitch, Twitter, uh, Google Plus, or Google Pages, I should say. Uh, yeah, Google Plus, that's where it is. Uh, so, if you're interested in, in finding out, obviously follow the video, go to the location, do all the jumping, get the. Uh, as I said, the thing that you're really looking for is, if I get rid of this, is that the one I joined, this boulder wasn't here. Oh, I don't remember it being here and it was a bit finicky to find but if you just kept playing and you can see that all this keeps glitching in and out and there's a perfect point that you get to just where the wall glitches the background disappears and the Leviathan presents itself Now, we're going to try, we're going to see if we can try, and the weird thing is, it, the mouth of it is just, just there, and it's just easy that it is, if you just do something funky with your eyes in this, it can appear. But as you can see, it's an, it's an absolute pain to do. But you can start to see that there's some of the rubble coming out. Why is it going now there is a way that if you just keep jumping, this blue thing will appear, like a blue star will appear just about here. And it's not a star, it's actually some of the graphical effects of the Leviathan going into into the mouth of something or coming out of the mouth of something. So But but anyway. This is the picture that you'll end up with. This is the picture that you'll end up with. That's what you want to see. That is cool. That's all I'm gonna show. Thank you very much for watching the video. And like I said, if you need anything else, go to www.damprofit.com. Uh you can also see my streaming channels on there. There's news stories. Uh, I'm doing a charity 24-hour stream in Destiny on the 15th of, Feb uh, 15th of September, which is Friday, from 6 p.m. Friday till 6 p.m. Uh, Saturday. Uh, check this out. It's really cool, and that's what you'll see. Thank you very much for watching.